right here is the Atari 2600 and that's uh, Miss Pac-Man in there in the cartridge and right here right here is the power on off here's the uh, TV type which is color or black and white switch up or down switch up or down the cartridge slot uh, this is the game select up or down and game reset up or down and then you got the power here you got the joystick here or paddle joystick or paddle paddle either one and then you got the joystick or paddle paddle outlet right there and um, right here right here is the AB switch which go back and forth and this has another AB switch right here inside you just have to use a, a knife or a pen to, to uh, switch it it does work and so does this this does work and the power right there goes to the wall which is yes the that's the power adapter for the Atari 2600. This plugs in the wall, goes to the Atari power, and then the um, the uh, part that goes to the TV is right here. This part right here that goes to the TV switch box, which is right here. I got the back open because I had to switch it from this this, which is um, the input from the Atari, that's the input from the Atari that goes to your TV here. Well, what I did is I switched it. So when you switch TV, it goes to your game instead of the other way around because it's a better connection with this kind of coaxial connection. So that's why I did that. And um, you can always get another switch box if you don't like that. Uh, but this shows a great picture. See right there? That's Miss Pac-Man, and it shows a great picture. That's why I did that, because it didn't show, it showed a staticky picture. See right there's Miss Pac-Man, and it's on the um, automatic play mode. But, um, but it sounds and, and looks good uh, the way I have it um, done right there. But, um... You can always get another switch box, or there's this one thing I think you can get on eBay for five or six bucks, and, and it's a coaxial cable uh, connection thing that that coaxial cable uh, screws to, and then it goes to your TV, and you don't even need that switch box. Because uh, I had one. It's like a gold color thing, but um, I had one at one point. So you don't even need that switch box. But um, then I got the... Atari joystick, of course, there, right there, there's two of them, see, two Atari joysticks, and they work great, those, 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 uh, two Atari joysticks work great, these pedal controls, these pedal controls, I have two sets of them, because see how they, they link together, two of them, they're, they link together, so there's always, on a pedal control, pedal control, they, they always link two together, now on a steering, I don't have steering, uh, but if I did have steering, right here, it would show a little car, orange car, and it doesn't. It's not linked together like this. It's only one, like it's only one, like your uh, joystick, like that. The Atari steering, but I don't have Atari steering, but I do have four pedal controls. And I find out later, after I buy two sets of um, pedal controllers, that there's a heavy-duty set of pedal controllers that uh, don't skip at all. These, both these sets, both these sets, the second player skips just a little bit so you can't play it like a game like Kaboom. And that's one of my favorite games and that's why I got these to play, to play Kaboom. So I just, I just play a two player and then use the second player as the, the player that I'm going to score on. Because the first player, it, it goes back and forth, it goes back and forth like this, it goes Goes like this, all the way across the screen like that. But the first player goes like this. It'll go, it'll go like this, and then it'll skip. It'll like skip, and that'll screw your game up, no matter what game you play. Uh, and these, that, these two sets are not heavy duty uh, 
a, a pedal controller. So, to correct that problem, since I had two sets, one, two, two sets of pedal controllers, and, and it was always the second pedal controller that didn't skip, what I tried to do, I tried to take the one off the other and put it on this one. And the wiring is the wiring code is different, but um, both all, all four pedal controls are the same. But the wiring code for the second um, or for the first and second player for the first and second pedal control um, are wired differently. And even though even though that I have that wire the best. The best you can do it by the you know different colored wires together, it still skips. The first player always skips with these pedal controllers. Always, nothing you do. And these are these are these were practically brand new. And uh, but they aren't the heavy duty ones. The heavy duty ones have, will have an Atari symbol, like right here. They have an Atari symbol right there. Pedal controller paddles, but they'll have a, a and those are those are uh, twenty bucks. 20 bucks a pair and I paid about half that for these and these these are these are half ass so I just want to let you know that the second the, the first player will always skip there's nothing you can do about it um, I've tried taking this cap off this cap off oiling it that little gizmo on the side taking the back off taking these two screws out oiling that little round thing in there and it helped it helped but Still skips. Nothing you can do. These are um, pedal. These these pedal controls are not the heavy duty ones. And and they even say on the eBay ads, the eBay ads for uh, uh, twenty bucks a pair, that these aren't these won't skip. So they know there's a problem. Um, Atari and everybody knows there's a problem with these with these pedal controllers. It's not the system. It's not the Atari twenty six hundred system at all. It's these pedal controllers, and um, you know, hey, if you want to be able, be able to beat everybody, just give them the first, <laughs> give them the first pedal control. They won't notice the skip probably, uh, because it's a very slight skip. But that slight skip throws you off. I can't, I can't get over ten thousand. I don't think. I, I, or what was it? I can't get over uh, up to ten thousand. I don't think with the skip one, but I can on the other one. I can get beyond 10,000 because 10,000 is when you get your uh, a bucket back if you're missing one. But um, on, on Kaboom, you get a bucket back. And if you're not familiar with Kaboom, oh well. <laughs> uh, I love the game. The game, the game. That's why I got these controllers is to play Kaboom. Plus, I got other other. Uh, I got other video games that'll that'll play um, with paddle controls. But always remember the first controller. So when you play a first player game, it's going to skip. I mean, you can play it. But like I said, the, the paddle, the, whatever you got on the screen is going to go like this. It's going to go, it's just going to go like this. Watch. Okay, on the, on the, sec, on the, uh, on the first one, it's going to go like this. It's going to move like this. And then it's going to skip. About half, half, half to mid screen. It will, it will skip. It will, it will, it will move fine like this, you know. But half to mid screen, it will skip like that. It skips about three pedal lengths on Kaboom. Um, so, uh, let's see. Uh, but, this, but the second player, so that's why I always play a two-player. I just, just dump the first player when I'm playing it and then play the real game on the second player. Um, I can play great with that way and uh, get over 10,000 or so. But... Uh, I just want to make sure you know that and make sure you know that I cut these, see? I can put that back on there. That's no problem. I can I can see this right here. This goes to there. You just take the same color wires out of there, same color wires out of here, which is four or five of them. You just connect them, and that'll work just, just like new. But um, I did everything in my power to make these right, and it's not it's not my it's not my Atari. It's, it's the... Um, it's the pad controls, the way they're made. The second, I guess, I guess there's a second company, the second generation of company that makes these pad controllers. But but the Atari ones are made by 
were, were made by Atari because I don't think they make these anymore. They don't make the uh, power controllers anymore, or the, I don't think the joysticks either. They don't make nothing no more, nothing good. <laughs> but um, let's go see the games. We're going over to see the games, and let me turn on the light here. And uh, let's see. Right there's my games, but I can get you a better picture because I got a. Uh, that way they're lit lit up. I got a I got a light right here. See this light? Got a light right here that that will light these games up, so you can see you can see the games that's coming with the system. Okay. So I'm I'm with the system. I'm putting Pitfall, Video Olympics, Street Racer. Circus Atari, Nisco Man, Surround, Yards of Revenge, Pac-Man, Warlords, Haunted House, Video Pinball, Asteroids, Centipede, Phoenix, Pole Position, Crystal Castles, Night Driver, Demons Diamonds, MASH, Air Sea Battle, Combat, this is a Star Wars, this is a Star Wars Empire Strikes Back, Atlantis, plus the Miss Pac-Man you saw in the game, in the uh, console, in the, in, the, um, in the Atari 2600, that's uh, this Pac-Man. So what I'm selling is the, the switch box, the cable going to the switch box, going to the uh, from from the uh, Atari 2600. The Atari 2600 um, the power cord, that power cord right there, going to the wall, which as you can see it's an Atari power supply. I'm selling uh, the two joysticks. That work great. They work really good, and the four, the four pedal controllers that I've already explained. So that's what I'm selling. If you want that, if you want that, this TV, which is a AC DC seven inch, as you can see, it's a NAXA NAXA um, TV. It's a seven inch. Um, DVD player. It's got a DVD player too. I'll, you see this right here it says push. It says push right there, right there, right under. See, the push. I push that, and right there's the controller or the controls. And right here's right here's the remote control to it. That takes one of them. Uh, it's a it's a, a coin cell battery, which ain't very expensive. They're under a dollar. <laughs> That's but that works perfect anyway. But um, if you want that 7 inch TV, AC, DC, um, it lasts for, I don't know how many, I don't know how long it lasts. Like, if you're, if you're playing a DVD, it don't last as long as if you're just watching TV. So I'm not sure how long, you'd have to look that up. Uh, it's a couple hours, I think, on one charge. But, um, but all I do is push that push that push right there, and there's a there's a DVD under there, and, uh, and then you switch from DVD to TV. To, it's also got a card card reader on it, and uh, I got I got the add to it. This tag this type N A X A uh, for a Craigslist ad, and I got that TV for a hundred and sixty dollars. But um, if you want that, but if you don't want that, um, I, I told you what you're getting for the uh, Atari 2600, the two joysticks, the four pedal controls, the power supply, the, the thing that goes to the TV, everything, you know, everything you need um, to play video games on the Atari 2600, and the Atari 600 is a great system, but um, let's go over here, oh shoot, I wanted to uh, show you these are the games. I'm, there's my light. I left the names on. Oh, oh well. That's my talking thermometer. 
But um, these are the games I'm keeping. Um, Keystone Caper, Miniature Golf, Turmoil, Demon Attack, Megaforce, Frogger, see Frogger, Berserk, Mousetrap, Superman, dun, 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 Superman, <laughs> uh, Boeing, Space Invader, Space Invaders, Mega Mania, and Kaboom, Kaboom, Kaboom. Them are the ones I'm keeping. And if you want those, you're going to have to pay me top dollar for those. Because uh, I plan on getting me another Atari. So, so that's it. That's what I'm selling. What I'm not selling. That's what I'm selling and what I'm not selling. And I have I have the PlayStation 2 Mega Man Anniversary Collection, which has uh, 10... Mega Man games on it, the 1 through 8 regular games and 2 arcade games that never came to the United States. So that's for the PlayStation 2. And I have uh, Xenophobe for the NES, Nintendo Entertainment System. Not the Super NES, but the NES. Uh, and that's Xenophobe, X-E-N-O-P-H-O-B-E -E by Sunsoft. Um, and I have... Metroid Prime for the GameCube. That's for the GameCube, Metroid Prime. So those three ain't coming with us either. Just th this, just these games right here. Just those games right there. And and, and uh, Miss Pac-Man, which was right here, was right there. But just these games. That. That row. And that roll. That's it. Those are those are the games that come plus Miss Pac-Man, which is in the system. And today is what is today? Nine. Let me just check my watch. Oh, today, right? There, see. Today is Friday. Nine twenty-five, twenty fifteen, at two o three p.m. That's what today is. And I am done with this video. I'll give you one last look at the video games. Today is 9-26-2015. It's on a Saturday at 2.08 p.m. First up for sale on my Craigslist listing is the Atari 2600, and it comes with two joysticks and two sets of paddle controls, which are four paddles. It comes with a power cord, which is right here. See, it's an Atari power cord. This goes to the Atari right there, and then the, um, the video source, the video cord goes to the switch box which goes to this TV See? TV so that's the first thing for sale on my Craigslist listing and uh, I got it for uh, $299 and this this is uh, great the greatest system ever the greatest video game system ever <laughs> and it comes with comes with those 24 games. There's 24 games there. And they're listed in alphabetical order. It goes uh, Yars Revenge, uh, Warlords, Video Pinball, Video Olympics, Surround, Street Racer, Star Wars, uh, The Empire, Empire Strikes Back, Pole Position, Phoenix, Pitfall, Pac-Man, Night Driver, Miss Pac-Man, Miss Command, Mash, Haunted House, um, Demons to Diamonds, Crystal Castles, Combat, Circus Atari, Centipede, Atlantis, Asteroids, Air Sea Battle. Those are all for the 
Atari 2600. That's 24 cartridges. Next thing I have for sale is, is this Garmin portable GPS. It's voice control. Um, you can it uh, tells you which turns you have to make before you have to make them and the distance you got to go yet. And it tells you all that by voice. Whenever you have to make a turn, it'll tell you that you have to make a turn before before the turn. And um, and then how far you got to go down that road and then the next turn. And it tells you ahead of time. But uh, this is the Garmin uh, portable GPS. I got it for, eh, it's probably about 560 some dollars at Best Buy. Uh, it's been a while back ago. I, I forget how long ago. Let's see. I got it to get my one dog. And uh, she, she's uh, going to be nine. So what's that? 2000, uh, 2000, about 2005, 2006, somewhere around there. That's when I got this at Best Buy for 500 and, and um, 60 some bucks. And it has a suction cup on the bottom and then this can be taken off here <laughs> but um it's that's the uh, portable by it's a portable GPS by Garmin and back then they were very expensive and this will tell you turn by turn by voice and also by map see watch view my view maps it's a touch screen this is a touch screen so it's kind of ahead of its time too because it's a, it's a, like a see, menu. See, it's a touch screen. And then uh, you got how loud you want it. See that, that loudness bar? Volume bar? And uh, like I said, it's, it's a touch screen. See where to? I can go here. And then it's got arrows to go on different screens. Like that. And tells you different things you can go and back. Lost satellite reception. See, see it goes by the uh, triangulish, triangulation of the, like, three satellites, I think. And I'm inside, so in a car it works fine. But uh, that's, that's, okay, now, now it's off the, um, now it's off the satellite and, and goes by its own memory. Um, but anyway. So, to go to different screens, you just push these arrows. That's it. And say near, near it. Uh, let's see. Cancel. Uh, then go back. See, it's got a nice touch screen back. And then, you know, you can, you can adjust it. You know, with, this, with that. Restore settings here. Back there. And then, what else also comes with this is this, this, um, it's uh, I'll show you. Okay, I'm unplugging it. See an external power loss. Continue on battery. It says, click. Okay, I haven't charged in a while, so, it, but it, but it's got a charge already, and it's only been a couple minutes. But um, see this? It's a USB. It's a USB, right there, to that connection, which is this, where where you saw it plugged in. So it's a UPS connection, or or. UPS USB connection this see You've seen that before haven't you it's on your computer and um, you can either plug that into your computer or if you have a plug like this it's a USB plug see I can plug it in see it's a USB plug okay and then then I just plug this into that and that charges it okay I can do it that way or I can or it also has power by that way and um, lost satellite reception. Okay, then then it has um, this cord, which is a, a cigarette lighter in your car cord, DC, and it goes to this, which goes into this right down here, down here on this side, one one of the sides. There's a um, that's that's the um, that right there is a suction cup. You put the suction cup down like that, and sucks it to the dash or or screen or wherever you're gonna suck it to. 
but oh, it's right here. It's right there. See, right there. You put it right in there, and then you put this in your cigarette lighter thing to, to keep continuous power to it, and it also charges it. And right here is the sound right here, and there's the speaker, and there's the on-off right there. See, sound, the speaker, on um, the speaker right there. This is on-off, and this is the sound. Okay. So that all connects to that, which is to the uh, suction cup. You can carry this thing down the street. <laughs> you can carry this thing down the street, and it'll tell you which turn to go. <laughs> but it's not. It's really nice. I mean, it tells you by voice. So you can even close your eyes. You can even close your eyes walking down the street. You know, tell you wherever to go. Plus, plus, it's got the map. See, view map. See, it's got a map, and then then it's got the plus map you know make the make it so you um, see more of the road or less of the road uh, by negative less of the road and then by positive more of the road so you just you just push that see there's nothing wrong with this at all and it's great for your car because hell you never get lost if you, let's say you miss a turn Lost satellite even, reception. Even though, it, even, even though it tells you to turn, let's say, uh, you just say, ah, uh, screw it, uh, I forgot about the turn. Well, your next turn, it'll tell you when to turn again and loop you around and get you back, and it'll keep on doing that until the damn thing can't do it no more. <laughs> I mean, if it, let's say you didn't have nothing to charge it with, it'll keep on doing that until until um, you don't have no more power. But, um, you know, if you're walking down the street uh, with that, and you missed your turn. It tell you. It tell you when to turn back, and uh, and where to turn back. Which street? This thing's good. All you have to do is update the maps on this, and shit, this this thing be, you know, 2015 compatible, or 16 or 17 or whatever, and and it's free. That you know, the the um, the actual service for GPS is free. Um, that's the uh, DC power. And that's the Garmin GPS that I got back in, what did I say? About 2005, 2006. And I love it. And uh, uh, I'll have it for sale. Let's see, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have it for sale for um, $75. If you can come up with seventy-five dollars, and this thing cost me five hundred. Lost satellite reception. And um, if, you know, I, I paid five hundred and fifty, sixty dollars, five hundred and fifty or sixty dollars for this thing. And now it's probably I don't know, it's, I don't know what it's worth really. But um, because nowadays iPhones and and different phones have uh, GPS on them, but but I don't know if they have voice control or not. You know, where I mean, voice where they tell you which way to go and the map, or just the map, or or both. I don't know if they have them. You can let me know in comments if you want. Um, you know, what the iPhone has, you know, by voice and by map or both. And because uh, really, I don't have any idea what this is worth, and most people don't. Because, you know, it's an all-in-one unit. It doesn't have anything to do with your phone, so you don't have to tie up your phone or anything. And, uh, you know, it's an all-in-one unit, so it's hard to say what that's worth. But you get this, the DC um, outlet plug-in, and you get that. The, the, uh, not, not this. Not this. You have to get that yourself because i got to have that for my phone. <laughs> Because anything USB, anything USB plugs in there, it'll charge or 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 it'll power. So that that is only gonna cost a couple bucks, I think. Plus you get a cord with it, I think. I think you get like a cord. Anyway, you get to this, you get this um, DC to to the um, power of the GPS, or and that's a cigarette lighter plug in, and or the USB plug in, and that goes into the uh, th that part goes into the, the uh, GPS, so USB to GPS. It's a USB on your computer. They'll charge that. They'll charge that GPS up, or you can get a fingle fangle thing like that, 
is a plug in UPS. Oh, I just want USB. <laughs> UPS been around a lot longer. <laughs> but uh, that's a USB plug in. That's all that is. And um, uh, they're cheap. But there they are. So that's what I'm selling. And today is, what is today? Today is 9 26. 2015 at 2:24 p.m. and look look to my next video or my next part of this video that I'm selling on Craigslist. Thanks. D-Link comes with a power cord, has two antennas, two antennas. That, that was kind of weird antenna. I don't know. This, this is supposed to be like this. I don't know how they got like that, but anyway, it works. It works perfectly. And uh, there's where it plugs in it. There's where the Ethernet is. And you plug one Ethernet into there. You got one, two, three, four LANs or Ethernet connections to your computer. Um, just need the proper wires for those and this. And, uh, you know, to be wired. And then to be uh, Wi-Fi, this turn this turns into Wi-Fi also. So you got Wi-Fi plus you got four four wire connections. It's called the, the D-Link, and I'm sure there's other ones, but um, I'm selling it for 15 bucks. If you want Wi-Fi at your house, hey, and you got one one Ethernet or internet connection, hey, you can have four four connections plus Wi-Fi. 15 bucks. Not bad. Forget what I paid for it. I paid more than that. I paid like 25 bucks. But anyway. Next up. Uh, this is another D-Link. Uh, Wi-Fi. And four connections again. Uh, you turn one connection into four connections. See? Back here, see there's, there's one, two, three, four LANs. From uh, one Ethernet right there. See Ethernet? And there's the power. And there's a power cord, so and then you can reset it. And um, this only has one antenna, which it works just as good as that other one. And um, this is far. Just this one has one antenna. See, this one's more compact and newer. This one's newer than the other one. And so that therefore it's more compact. It's actually more powerful, powerful probably. And this one I'm selling for twenty dollars. Not bad. Now, when you consider you take one connection from from say Charter or uh, whatever cable company you got, put it right there. Now you got Wi-Fi after you after you uh, set it up, and one, two, three, four LAN connections. You can have four different devices there, wired plus Wi-Fi. Here's the control panel in the front. It's got all those lights, you know, like like your modem. But if you want Wi-Fi and you want more connections from your one connection, here it is. It's a D-Link. Look it up. Uh, you can look it up on the internet. It's all over the place. Uh, it works great. And 20 bucks ain't bad. I know I paid more than that. <laughs> but anyway, that's it. Thanks. Hey, what up, everybody? <laughs> oh, this is uh, this is a a kitchen nook, and this is the wall. This is the wall. So, what do you call that? Whatever you call between the kitchen and the, the living room area. Um, but there's a, there used to be a wall right there, and then they they switched it over so it's, you know you can view it from throughout the house. But anyway, it's got a little lip right here. See, and see this right here. This is a this is a a drinking glass clip or clamp. See? You can put it on your finger. <laughs> you can put it on your finger. Oh. <laughs> oh, it's just a second. See, I got it on my finger. Ah! Ah! Oh. No, it's a, it's a, it's a drinking glass clip or clamp. See? It's made out of durable, durable high-impact plastic. I used to work at a plastics company. I know what plastic is, and that's... This is high impact, very durable. See, it's like a little mousetrap thing. You find it in a mousetrap. 
but that's a lot thicker and bigger. But anyway, it's a little, it's a clamp. Just clamp it there. See this glass of water? It's got water. Water's kind of probably your heaviest, your heaviest you're ever gonna put in this. See? See, it's a drinking glass full of water and a clamp that I just put there. <laughs> drinking glass full of water. The clamp I just put there. Just put it there and drink, set and forget. Or don't forget and drink it. <laughs> but uh, that's what that is. That's a, that's a, it's like a big clothespin. See, I got, I got one here. I got one there. I hold this up. But I got, a, I got two of them for sale, though. That red one and probably another one somewhere. But I got two of them for sale for $4. So... It's great. It has great use to it, and uh, that's it. Thanks a lot for watching. Four dollars. Here's a great device that most people probably would, would like. It's an AC/DC um, rechargeable TV, seven-inch TV by NAXA, NAXA. And see this right here? This right here, you, it says push. Now let's push it. You see now, now, now let's see. See, there's a DVD in there. <laughs> see? And it's relatively small. See? See where that cable connection goes? It's probably about four times that wide. It's about four times uh, cable connection wide. And then it's got the little stand right there. But, uh, then, then this thing tilts too, see? See, it tilts, uh, tilts up and back like that. And then just click it again, and you got TV again. And you got, it's a card reader too. And it's a, this is a widescreen. And man, this thing's, got a, this thing's got a great picture. You'd have to see my Atari. Just, just, just type in Atari 2600 Kelman's in Michigan. And you'll see the great picture of this. And, or any, any of the video games I have on my website. Because after you go to the Atari, uh, my uh, ad for the Atari 2600, that thing right there, <laughs> uh, you can see all the video games because I, I taped them, and I taped them with this thing. See, that's the, that's the uh, iPad holder, and I, I just taped that up, and it holds the iPad so I can tape my video games on that, which is um, an AC-DC TV DVD player. And uh, a card reader. It's got a card. You can put a card in there and read like, pictures and stuff off of it. Plus that. And it also comes with this. See, that's a remote control. I got it upside down, silly. <laughs> See? N A X A. And type that in, and you see that $160 is not a bad price for this. Plus, you get a, a two and a half year warranty. The reason I say two and a half is because I got a three year warranty with it. And um, I used it for a couple months, so so you got you got you know two and a half year warranty on this thing right now. All you got to do is bring it to me, or I can transfer it probably uh, the warranty because that cost me another uh, I think it was like twenty five dollars or thirty five dollars something like that. But when you're dealing with a DVD player, warranty is a good thing. <laughs> so I've had lots of DVD players, and. Uh, Sometimes you just don't hold up because I, I played them constantly. Like I'd turn them on when I go to sleep and they'd be still playing when I'm not, <laughs> I wake up, you know, eight, nine hours later because <laughs> I got that kind of DVDs. See this right here? This DVD, this Lost in Space DVD? That'll play uh, 12 or 13 Lost in Space episodes. So you add it up. You know, let's, say, let's say 12. That's six hours right there on that one. And I had I, I had ones that played 24 hours, one DVD, because it depends on what format it's in. I had a DVD recorder. And I had I had a few of them that played, you know, over 10 hours. And I had one that I played over 24 hours that I made. But anyway, besides that, there, that, that TV is a great TV. <laughs> It's rechargeable. It doesn't have no batteries in it. It has a, a permanent battery inside. And you plug it in. And it comes with a cord right here. It comes with a power cord right there. 
See? That's the power cord to it. The same, yeah. The angles to it. See, it's right up there to it. But anyway, a power cord comes with it. And the old remote control you can't live without comes with it. <laughs> and that's about it. 260 bucks ain't bad. I'm not 200. 160 bucks. Sorry about that. 160. <laughs> and it comes with a two and a half year warranty. Next up is the car scraper with a little fuzz, with a little brush on it, with a brush on it. See, that gives you an idea how big it is. And also, I got, I got a tape I can, I can put it on it. Let's see, but uh, that's the, let's see, let's see what how long this is. Okay, this is. Okay, it's um, let me here, about 25 inches from from there to there, 25 inches. So that's a car scraper, scraper, and you know these are a bitch to find before before um, before you know just before winter. I was looking all around, going, Shh, I need one of these damn scrapers, you know, for the ice on the window and snow and stuff. And uh, I couldn't find them. You got to be damn near, it's almost got to be, your windshield almost got to be uh, iced over. <laughs> and by that time, it's too late, ain't it? Well, you can get in and warm your car up and unfreeze it that way, but uh, it's kind of hard to find sometimes. Anyway, I'm selling this for 10 bucks. This is made out of, this is made out of, um, Five glass. That's five glass. And then this is made out of probably nylon, nylon brush, which is very. Both are very strong plastics. Ten bucks ain't bad. Hey, contact me. What this is is a monocular. You call them, you know when it's got two of them, it's called a binocular. This is called a monocular. And uh, I don't know if that means anything to you, or that means anything to you, but um, you got that, and, and what I do is, I look at the groundhogs out there, out in the yard, I look, in, I look at the groundhogs, they go like this, like this, and then I dial them in, it's a bitch so see right there, that's, what is that, about 20 yards or so. Um, see, no, that'd be, that'd be about 10 yards, I think, 10 yards, yeah, because that'd be, what, 30 feet, be about 30 feet out there, but, uh, that's a monocular, it's my peeper, <laughs> I watch the groundhog with it, but, um, I forget what it cost me, but I'm selling it for less than that. It's um, see, monocular. Uh, this monocular is 16 by 52, uh, 6 6 m by 8000 m. Dual focus. This has the dual focus. You twist this and twist that, like right here and right here. I think it is twist. And I'm selling it for nine dollars. It's a monocular. That's it. See that right there? That's a mongoose. That's the mongoose. And see, it has mongoose on here somewhere, I think. Oh, right there on the sea. There, see, it says mongoose. Mongoose, and it's got a mongoose lock. And um, that's a that's a 21 speed. And then the 29 inch tires. That's the only problem with the 29 inch tires are a little bit bigger than most most tires, so. It, the tire, that, that front tire or the back tire won't fit in a um, bicycle rack, so, but, it, but it does fit enough where I can lock it up to it, so. Um, then it's got disc brakes, see? That's the disc brakes on the front, disc brakes on the back, and then 21 gears on the back, and this, this lock comes with it. 
the speedometer. See, I got. See, it goes up to 50 miles an hour. Yeah, like I'm gonna go that fast. <laughs> but I bet you could, man. <laughs> I don't know. It's uh, I got 213.4 miles on. Other than that, it's new. It's new with 213.4 miles on it. You know, like cars. You, you get a car. It has so many miles on it. And I put all those miles on myself. It's got the uh, reflectors, of course, and the lock, and the seat, and, and two baskets. These baskets just got a bungee cord right there. But uh, these baskets, see how that's locked right there? I lock it right there. Let's see if I can get that undone. There, see how I'm locking the same thing with the other side. You unlock it. Well, the bungee cord ain't let me. Okay. So you unlock it, and then you put this down, all the way down. You watch. It's all the way down. Like that. And now you got a basket. See, it's I got a uh, zip strip right there. That's a nylon zip strip. And I've had a lot of weight in there. And I, then I tied this one because up here, it's a little, they're like, it's connected to the seat, so I just tied it with a rope. If that breaks or cuts, I just tie that with a rope. And this is aluminum. This is aluminum body. And these are steel baskets, but... Uh, I tie it also. I have a rope there and this bungee cord. This old bungee, the old bungee, the old bungee cord. I have a nice bungee cord on it. And uh, then I have a nylon rope right here attaching this one and then a zip strip down there, right down there, see? Anyway, and it's got three, it's got three gears in the front, derailleur, and it's got um, seven in the back. So three times seven is... 21 oh yeah okay now this right here will cost you twenty dollars this right here with the chain and the lock twenty dollars this right here this basket guess how much yep twenty dollars guess how much this basket is oh yep you're right twenty dollars um <laughs> yep so you got twenty forty sixty eighty dollars right there and then the bike guess how much the whole bike costs I'm selling it for $299. So, if you like what you see, uh, hey, it's for sale. And I'm by bike anyway, so I'd have to get another bike, but that's okay. Whatever. Um, everything I have is for sale. I always say that. You know, whenever I buy anything, if I buy, when I bought this brand new, it was for sale. Um, so, everything I have is for sale. So, that's it. Oh, the oh, the, oh, the tires. The tires are um, the tires is a is a trail trail bike tire and a road tire. This is a road trail bike tire, a roll a road trail bike tire. It's not it's not real knobby like a like just a um, a mountain bike. A mountain bike. That's like a mountain bike is really knobby. The more knobby it is, the slower it slows you down. The more slick it is, the so you can you can put slicks on this. Or not slicks, but racing. Call them racing tires. They're a little skinnier, and they're they're almost like a slick, except for they have a they have a tread going this way. Like this, they have like four or five treads going like that on, on the racing tire. Not like this across. See, that means it's like a saw. It's like a saw, and and um, with knobby tires like that, it slows you down. But anyway, uh, compared to a racing bike tire, and that's what I have to say. Two hundred ninety nine dollars. That's it. Next up for sale is four guitar picks. One, one, two, three, four. Four guitar picks. Uh for two dollars and I have let's see one two three sets of them so that's it four guitar picks for two dollars so what is that what, 50 cents a guitar pick and done Okay, I have uh, some glasses here for sale. 
Um, three dollar. Okay, now it's it's sunglasses. This sunglass is what I have for sale. See, it's got a mirror finish, got a mirror finish to it, so they can't see your eyeballs. So, uh, or it's real hard for them to, depending on light. But um, it's mirrored sun sunglasses for three dollars. See, uh, yeah, I can see, you can see me. <laughs> but um, instead of looking at them, you look at yourself in the, in it. See, <laughs> that's me. Yeah. Uh, um, but, uh, I got three pairs of safety glasses, just regular clear safety glasses, and I'm going to give a pair of those for free to whoever buys this for three dollars, for, uh, three dollars for these sunglasses mirrored. And then you get a free pair of your choice, whichever pair you want of those three safety glasses. Got the slick kind. Got the boxed-in kind, where, where you can put uh, glasses, put these over glasses, or you got another stick kind. So, you choose, you pick, you buy. Three dollars for these mirrored sunglasses. Not too bad. Here we go, some... What's that? Techno cells? Techno cell. See? Techno cell. This lithium batteries. Premium. Premium lithium batteries. They are CR 2025s. And what does these batteries and this remote have in common? This uses one of them. <laughs> and um, I'm selling this, not the remote, but these batteries. These one, two, three, four, five batteries. I'm selling for five bucks. So it's a dollar a battery, not bad. Consider how long they last. Long last a long time. And these have these have a um, uh, expiration of right there. Expiration of 12, 2017. Let's see, each one of those, each one of these batteries have an expiration of 12, 2017. And so on this, not the remote, but this for five bucks. I bought a bunch of them off eBay because I thought I could just, you know, sell them, you know. And, um, because the more I bought, the less it cost me. So I got a bunch of these. I, I don't know, I got like 25, I think, of them. Maybe 30. Hey, Iron Man, Iron Man fans. <laughs> The Invincible Iron Man. See, Invincible right up there. Invincible Iron Man. This is an Iron Man adult medium t-shirt. Brand new. With tag. See, tag. And this right here is an Avenger. Brand new. See, tag right there. And this is an adult medium t-shirt. And that's Avenger. Tag. Avenger. Tag. Avenger, tag, Iron Man, tag, Iron Man, tag, Iron Man, tag, and you can have either one of these shirts for eight bucks, eight dollars, that's about what I paid for them, um, I tried to make some money and sell them for 15 bucks, but tag said 20 bucks on them, I'm going, yeah, right, I'm going to get that, um, So, um, I'm just going to try to break even here, and uh, either one, the Iron Man for 8 bucks or the Avenger shirt for 8 bucks. See that right there? That's a, that's a forehead, 3,000 lemon LED light. And I'm selling it for twenty dollars. It's very bright. See the switch right here, right there. Watch. That's the three thousand lemon light, and then you click it again. Now it's about a thousand five hundred. It's about half. And you click it again. It's off. See that's the click. Okay. This right here, right there is where you recharge it. 
and you get a you get a um, that's a lithium battery, and you get a, a plug-in that plugs into here. Look at that, see? It's a plug-in. It's an AC plug-in. So you don't have to worry about ever replacing it with batteries. It's got a built-in battery. This is good. That's a 3000 lemon forehead light. Fits on your forehead. It's great. It lights the way really good. You can, you can uh, put it on a boat. You know, you can put it on your head, put it... So you're in a boat, so you got a light, so you're legal on the, on the water at night. You can go down the road, you know, so people can see you. And so you can see, um, you know, on a, on a totally dark road, you can do a lot of things with it. You can ride your bike, on, you know, if you have that on your head, you can ride your bike, you'll be legal at night. Um, plus a bunch of other uses, but uh, it comes in this box right here. It's an LED. Hmm. 20 bucks, not bad. See, now I have uh, seven colored uh, um, wigs. Seven colored wigs. See, there's a pink one, pink one, a blue one, red one, purple one. That's some purpley. Nice and green wee, lemon yellow, and orange orange. So that's uh, the seven, the seven. Chorus play or, or um, pretty wigs, you know, they're, they're cute, they're cute. Um, you know, instead of dyeing your hair pink, just put on a wig. Instead of dyeing your hair blue, just put on a wig, red. Run away, purple, run away, green, wig, yellow, wig, orange, wig. Do it, do it. It will be fun. Um, they're nice. And they're $10 each or two for, what I say, see, $10 each. I forget what my deal is, but it's $10 each. <laughs> and if you buy three, oh, that's right. If you buy three, it's uh, twenty-five dollars. If you buy three of them, it's twenty-five dollars. Um, if you buy one, it's ten. If you buy one pink, blue, red. These are all I got: it's purple and green, yellow and orange. These are all the colors I have, and all the wigs I have for sale. So if you buy three, it's twenty-five dollars. If you buy just one, it's ten dollars. Um, if you buy two, you know that's you just buy two. <laughs> but if you buy three, you know it's twenty-five dollars. So you save five bucks. What I'm trying to say. Here's the uh, the Canon. It's a printer, copier, and scanner. See right there's the printer, and there's the power cord to it. See, right there, that goes to, looks like a toaster. <laughs> looks like a toaster uh, connection. But uh, that, that's the uh, power cord to this printer, copier, and, see, printer, copier, and scanner. See, there's the thing for paper. There's the thing for the scanner. And there's the side. Where's the uh, power stuff? It's uh, uh, MG2920. And then. And you got the scanner right there. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. And the printer part's down there. You can pull this out. Pull this thing out right here. See that thing comes out. Goes back in. That and the paper goes up there. On there, and this is this is a um, wireless. It's a wireless Canon. It don't have no ink in it. I didn't know. It says it on the ad and stuff when I bought it off eBay. See, it don't have no ink. Right there's the place where you put the ink, though. Right there, there, and there. So I would say it's probably the black one there. 
let's see what is it be the black one there and then two colors there and two colors there i think or wait a minute no okay there's only two there's two um okay so the black one there and the color one there that's what it is yeah because there's only two of them in there so and then it has instructions right there but anyway that's that's the uh yeah that's all right there and then that's the power cord and that's the printer i have for uh 35 dollars and that's about what i paid for it um, I didn't want to ship it back because it didn't have no ink, you know, because it's going to cost me probably 10 bucks to do that. So by that time, you know, it cost me 25 bucks already. So, you know, so, well, make me an offer. Um, you know, it's brand new. It's never been used. As you see, there ain't no cart there ain't no ink cartridges. So how could I use it? I couldn't. I can't. Not without ink. And ink is, you know, you know, Ink's always expensive, so I don't know how expensive. I think you can get it for twenty to thirty dollars or something like that for the the the, the uh, black and black cartridges and the um, the color cartridges. I don't know. You'd have to check it. You know how much the ink would cost you. It's gonna be like twenty thirty dollars. So I paid thirty five for the, <laughs> the printer. Uh, I think that guy on eBay just just. Uh, banks on that people won't read that saying because almost all new printers come with ink and um that's probably how the guy's making his money on on uh ebay selling empty empty you know printers without any ink or cartridges so i'm just trying to get my money back out of it make an offer hey i ain't got this sold yet so just go ahead and make me an offer and let's make a deal I got it for thirty-five dollars right now. About what I pay. I think I paid thirty-seven. I don't know. But anyway, I'm just trying to take, cut my losses. See right there, that's a boomerang. It's well built. It's well built. It's um. It's kind of. It's got sponge on the outside, like that's a, like a hard sponge, and um. It's got this inside. See right there, the inside. Got that solid, solid piece of plastic there, and then this is like a hard sponge. I threw it a lot, see? So now it's used. <laughs> and I like it. It, it, it. I got it caught up in a tree about 30 feet in the air, 25, 30 feet. And I, it's, luckily, there was people putting side on this, this apartment complex, and he said, yeah, go ahead and use the ladder. Damn, the ladder was heavy, so I know it's about 25, 30 feet up. But um, that's a boomerang that I have for sale for twenty dollars, and uh, I'm gonna give you some more boomerangs too. I'm gonna give me like a wooden one, cause, cause they're pretty cool. I, I like I like them. You know, it's hard. it don't come back right right back to you a lot of times, cause if you don't throw it exactly right according to the wind, you know the wind, because you, you throw it according to the wind. See, this is an eighteen inch wingspan from there to there, eighteen. 18 inch from there to there. It's an 18 inch wingspan boomerang. I tried some cheap ones. Don't buy them. Huh. They're made out of plastic and they're like, uh, I'll show you. I'll show you. Um, it's cost me like a dollar something each, I think. And they ain't worth that. They ain't even worth that. They, I don't know what you do with them. Because they certainly hell don't come back. I'll show you it in a second. See, where is that? Right there. See that? Throw it. Puh. That thing don't come back. See, nice package. Nice package deal. If you want one, I'll sell. I'll sell one to you for a dollar. Cost me like a dollar fifty, I think. But um, yeah, right. These. I, I want to throw it just just the way it's do the other one. I don't have the weight on there. Those are real light because it's just real thin plastic. If you don't have the weight, it ain't gonna work. Where do I put that? Oh, okay, it's right there. That's the boomerang I'm selling, twenty dollars. Better have the weight. Now this is a Google tablet, and uh, I got it to replace my other computer, but actually I can't afford it because uh, I need fifty bucks um, for my rent <laughs> by the first part of this month. 
And see, this is what I can replace right here, see? There's my computer I use. It's got 12 keys missing. See, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. There's 12 keys missing on it. I was going to replace it, but I, I, uh, I used the on-screen on -screen keyboard. And it comes with all windows. And um, so I'm happy with that. Uh, but this is a 10.1 10, 10 um, Google Android. And it's a 1.3 gigahertz with a quad. Each one of the a quad means it has four four processes in it. You know, like one, two, three, four processes. I mean, if if one if you have a anything that has this one processor like that computer over there does, um, that I just showed you, that's a 1.6 gigahertz. Well, with this being a 1.3 gigahertz. But it has one, two, three, four processors. It's, it's actually going to be a lot faster than that 1.6 over there. And uh, it comes with a with this little this little pamphlet um, that shows you how to use it and stuff. See, it's got oh, let's see, got that like that. Got a card reader. And uh, oh, okay, there. There, whatever that is. Okay. And that's, uh, and there's, there's a camera. See, there's a camera. And there's a camera on this side, too. You got a camera right there. So, um, it's got a front and back camera. You can turn it on right here. See, right? Where is it? I got upside down, silly. Got upside down right there. You turn it on. You turn it on. You turn this on. There. Okay. <coughs> I guess you gotta hold it down. There. Okay, see, that's what it said on the back of it. What's that? Tag Tagatel? Tagatel? See there's the Android little Android dude. And right here's the pamphlet. And right there, see it's coming up. Okay. Android KitKat 4.4. That's what that's what system it uses. You know the uh, operating system. Android Kit KitKat 4.4. And there, let's boot it up. I'm not sure exactly how you use this. You know, but um, let's see. I don't know why it does that, but maybe you go like this. Let's see. Oh, there it goes. Oh, well, I guess it wasn't done loading. I don't know. Okay, so go here. There's keyboard. And there, now I'm back to there. Okay, that, that's what it was. It wasn't done loading, I guess. I guess I'm just too quick for it. But it's a 1.3 gigahertz four times. So this this is, you know, pretty fast. Um, a lot faster than uh, just one uh, processor or two processors or twice as fast as the two processor so because the reason is, is uh, the theory is I guess is is each processor can do a separate thing by itself so so with my computer over there my computer over there it's a 1.6 gigahertz it might be fine by doing one application probably faster than this but if I go two applications this will be faster if I go three it'll be twice as fast and four like three times as fast um, because each one of them operations would have would have a processor on its own on this because it's got four it's a quad that's the theory so and and they're they're leaning towards that theory uh, uh, with being a quad on all all the laptops and tablets tablets this tablet and um, so you got all this stuff on here see that's a, that's a um See there, there's a, there's a settings there, settings, and you get that. It looks like an iP looks like an iPhone, <laughs> but uh, I've never used this. And this is a um, speaker, a speaker. It's got a built-in speaker, but uh, and, and uh, re, re uh, refresh. And there's another speaker. 
I'm not sure why. Oh well, whatever. I, I'm not sure. I'm not, I'm really not sure on this because I've never used it. I'm not sure what that does. Let's see, this always goes back. This 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 right here always goes back. It's like an iPod, I, iPhone. I don't know what the M is. I can't really demonstrate this thing. That's, um, let's see, it's got a browser, calculator, calendar. I guess this is all in the application. The KitKat 4.4 application. Camera, clock, downloads, email, movie, studio, maps, hangouts, Google settings, Google, Google Mail. File manager, I'm surprised it doesn't say file Google. <laughs> um, but as you can see, it's a, definitely a brand name, Google. Music, Play Store, Settings, um, Sound Record, rec Record, okay. UHD Player, Update, and Voice, voice, share. Huh, I don't know. I'm not sure what that means. And then it's got, see how, see how I moved that all aside? That's YouTube. That's it. I can bring it back, see? See how I moved that? I go like this. It's just like an iPhone. This is just like an iPhone, except for, except for it's, a, um, it's a lot bigger. See, this is the iPhone right here I'm using. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, okay. That's what I got to say. And let's see. This comes with a this comes with a USB. What do you call it? USB. It's a it's a um. It comes with a a mini USB to a full size USB. It comes with that adapter. And that adapter. Okay, I know where it's at. It's in my, it's in this thing. Cause I was showing, I was gonna show, I was showing this to a computer guy. And uh, right here, right here's what you get. The, see that? That's a, that's a. This cost me extra. This was more than what that iPad. Uh, this this cost me extra from that that um, that tablet. This goes from this go, go this goes from. Uh, that's a mini. USB to a um, Ethernet. It's the Ethernet thing that comes out of your comes out of your uh, um, modem. Goes to your computer. Well, you do the same thing with this to your to your um, tablet or whatever you have that has a mini that has a mini USB. Mini USB to Ethernet, and it also has a mini USB to a normal USB, and that's what you get. Those two right there, those two right there, and this nice brand new tablet that that I don't that um. You know, I, I, like I said, I don't even know how to use it, so it hasn't been used yet. So it's brand new. I bought it to replace, like I said, my um, this laptop. This is a 1.6 gigahertz laptop, and I use I use the um, on screen the on screen keyboard. I, I just use that and this mouse. Let's see right here, the on screen keyboard. That's what I use instead of this because this is missing 12. Like I said, it's missing a dozen, a dozen keys, and try to type when two of them, two of them, two or three of them don't work. Like that R right there, that's an R, and there's an N there somewhere. I think there, that don't work, and then there's a um, comma or something right there, that don't work either. The other things, if you push on them, they'll work, but um, when you're missing an A and R. 
and an N, try to type that way. Try to try to type out anything that way. I ain't missing nothing up here on the on the on screen keyboard. So I'm fine with it. The reason I was gonna replace that is because it's run really running real slow and it's it was acting up and stuff. But I found out it had a lot of viruses and stuff on on that uh, that laptop over there. It had a lot of viruses and so to get rid of any virus, all you have to do is format the hard drive, and that's exactly what I did. I formatted it with my, my with this disk, with Windows Pro, XP Pro, Windows XP Pro. Yeah, I got Windows 10 there, but I don't have the code, so after every 30 days, I have to reformat the hard drive, or, uh, yeah, I have to reformat the hard drive. I could use Windows 10 that way, because what I do, what I do now, and since I've had this trouble before with viruses and stuff, I have a, this is either one or two gigabyte hard drive, external. It's an external USB hard drive. It's like a one gigabyte or two gigabyte external hard drive. So what I do, whenever I have information on my computer, I put it on there, and then all I have to do is switch a couple files. You know, I'll, I'll format that hard drive, I'll form, format the hard drive on that, if, if I have any viruses at all, format that, then I'll just plug that into it, and just switch two files over after I format it. So that's what I do from now on, screw that. I'm done with this virus crap. Always messing you up and trying to get your information, get your ID, and, but um, anyway, this, this has never been on the internet, so it don't have no virus. And, uh, I'm not sure exactly how you set it up so that you can use the mini USB to um, the Ethernet and and or how to set up for Wi-Fi. But um, uh, let's see, I got a, I got a D-Link that switches uh, that switches um, your one incoming um, internet connection, which is off your modem to your ISP or your cable cable supplier and switches that to four wired uh, internet connections so you can have four different devices plus it makes it uh, Wi-Fi so um, I'm gonna I'm gonna sell this for well I got seventy dollars seventy dollars wrapped up in the, the that one extra uh, mini USB to to uh, Ethernet and the price of this I got seventy dollars wrapped up into it and this is brand new and this didn't come with no box see I, I talked to a lady about this she said oh does a does a does a box come with it I said uh, the box never came with it it came in an envelope uh, you know a, pa a bubble pack pack envelope or a box with with um, with a bubble pack around it. I think it was a box with a, with a bubble pack around it because it had a lot of bubble pack around it. Um, I was surprised it was a big box like that. And that's where I got a lot of my bubble pack. See, I'll show you my, show you my bubble pack, all my bubble pack I got. See that up there? <laughs> all that up there is bubble pack, but not just from this one thing. I think like this roll and that right there was all from just that. Just this tablet. I mean, the tablet works fine. There's nothing wrong with it. No scratches. It's brand new. But uh, I'll get, I'll get, if you pay me, let's see, I'm gonna I'm gonna charge um, sixty dollars. I got it for seventy dollars right now. I'll just take a ten dollar loss. Plus a loss that I paid for my um, USB or not my USB, but my um, for um, well yeah my USB my mini USB to to uh, to Ethernet connection that I showed you over there. And um, and the loss on my D-Link, the D-Link I paid twenty three dollars for. I'm, I'll I'll give you I'll give you the D-Link one of the D-Links that I have uh, in the ad on Craigslist and on this video. I'll give you one, and I'll take a ten dollar loss because I need fifty dollars right now. Plus you get the. Um, Cord I showed you. To, did, I show, did, I, did I show you a cord? Yeah, right here it is. It's right here it is. Yeah, oh, no, that ain't it. That's not it. That's not it. 
Let's see. I got a cord around here somewhere. Okay, that goes to that. This goes to Atari. This goes to... I think this, this is it. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Oh, no, that ain't it, I don't think. Let's see. Oh, that's the other one. It's the other one I got. It's, oh, shit. I switched the two around here, I think. <laughs> oh, let's see. Okay, where'd I put that? Okay, that's the um, thing to that. And, okay, that, okay, that's right there. Oh, shoot, that's right. I, yeah, I know what I do with it. I know what I did with it. I put it in here. I was going to show that guy. That's right, it was right there. Oh, where was it? Oh, let's see. Okay, whatever. <laughs> oh, shit. That's the, um, that's the headlight, or the, um, that's this. That's that. No, that's not that. That's that. Okay, so now. Uh, it's around here somewhere. There's the two things there. Well, I, I know what I did with it. Put it in here. See, always out of mind, out of sight. <laughs> right there it is. That's why I was going to show that one guy. And see, this. See, see how much skinnier than that is than that other thing? I, I'm going, geez, that thing is quite big for this. See, that's what the, that's how big that thing looks. And the other thing, that's for my light, that, that headlight. But, um, see how small that is? That plugs right into, right into there. That's the AC. But that's what you get. And like I said, I'll, I'll sell you this for $60. I'm taking a $10 loss there, and then I'll take a loss on my my D-Link that I paid like 20, 20, $25 or $30 for, I forget. But um, So you have Wi-Fi for this, and you have, um, you're able to connect uh, through Ethernet to that one adapter I have, so you can go right from, you know, have a wired connection, and... So I'll just take a loss on this, $10, and you get the uh, D-Link that changes your one incoming internet to four wired internet internet connections, which are L L LANs, and uh, then the Wi-Fi. That's it. Next up is packing tape. Yep, you got it. It's packing tape. Two dollars a roll. Um, you going? Oh, two dollars a roll. Oh, I paid. I, I paid three fifty a roll. Three dollars and fifty cents a roll at Myers, and it had like a fifth of what this has on it. This has three hundred thirty yards on it. They had. See, this has three hundred thirty-three yards, or three hundred thirty something like that. No, it's three hundred thirty something. But uh, 330 yards. The one I bought bought from Myers had a little little rinky dink thing on it where where it just had this just had this this cutter and then this like this part around it and it was smaller it was smaller like like about that big and it had 47 yards on it 47 yards so that's what one two six almost seven there's almost seven times the amount on this and that one I paid three fifty at Myers for three dollars and fifty cents. That's right, three three dollars and fifty cents. And um, and uh, I've seen for more than that at Myers. That was the cheapest they had for forty seven yards. This has three hundred and thirty yards on it. Three hundred and thirty. See how big a roll that is? Plus the plus the roll's a lot bigger than than it. It's not any thicker this way. You know, from all this all this right here going around, 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 around. This thing go around this damn apartment complex a couple times. <laughs> it's got a lot. It's got a lot of. It's got a lot of tape on it. I, I took this to to a um, pawn shop place 
Oh, I can go to, I can go to, uh, um, 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 I can go to, um, the, uh, dollar store and get it for a dollar. Yeah, right. Tell me another one, man. I just, I just got back from, just a week ago, from the, from the, uh, dollar store. I bought one for, uh, what was it, a dollar thirty-five, I think it was, a dollar thirty-five. And they had about the same. They had like, they had like, uh, 47 yards or something. I think they got a 47 yard thing in their heads for selling it. And I paid a dollar or something for 47 yards. And that was just for the roll. And that didn't have a thing on it. And, uh, so, uh, so what you do is wrap and cut with a knife. But, um, these right here have 330 yards. Way, 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 way more. And they sell from, like, I think they sell from $5 to to two dollars on the eBay if you buy buy one or two or three or four rolls. Um, see, as you see, I have six rolls right there. I have twelve rolls right now, and um, I'm selling for two dollars a roll or whatever my ad says. Um, you know, if you buy more than one roll, you get a little more discount. And um, so I'm making hardly nothing on these things, and. Uh, so, but that's my, that's, that's been my, um, my, uh, tape machine for 30 years, I think, 20, 30 years. I bought that at, uh, where did I buy that from? I bought it from an office place, uh, and, on, on, uh, this was before, I think it was even before the internet, <laughs> but, uh, because the internet wasn't around until around 1990 is when it first started getting going, 1990. Um, it was around, but... Not many people were on it because they charged by the hour. But uh, and now that 1990 was the time when computers were. I bought a computer in 1990 at, at Radio Shack without without a monitor. It had to have a monitor too, but without the monitor, uh, it was over two thousand dollars, and it was a 10 megahertz, 10 megahertz. That one over there. That one over there, 1.6 gigahertz. Way, way, you know, I don't know how many hundred times that is faster than that, than that, that uh, tablet. See, that's 1.3 gigahertz with, with a quad. <laughs> that's a lot faster than 10 megahertz. But uh, I paid $2,000 for that and then another seven or 800 for the monitor. So almost $3,000. Computers were expensive back then. I lost my ass good. And then just barely any RAM. I think 256, 256 RAM, I think it was. And they were saying, oh, I ain't going to get no faster than 10 megahertz. That's what they were trying to pawn off. Did you say it's 10 gigahertz or megahertz? <laughs> anyway, two hours roll, packing tape. Here's a nice back scratcher with a, with a um, bear paw on it. It's telescoping. See, I got this between my legs. Uh, don't get any ideas. See, it telescopes from that to that. See, it's like a it's like your TV antenna or a, a radio antenna on your car. See, it expands See, like that. Now watch. See, here it is. <laughs> Here's the old back scratcher. See, it telescopes. Back scratcher. Mmm, that feels good. Or you can go this way. Whichever way you want, it's a back scratcher. It's nice. And I have it for what? What do I have it on? I have it for, uh, what? This fingle fangle gadget, a telescoping back scratcher. I have it for three bucks. Nice. Oh, 
Okay, we got we got a Mega Man anniversary collection. There's ten games on here uh, for the play for the PlayStation Two. Uh, this is for the PlayStation Two, and there's ten games uh, by Capcom. And this is Mega Man the anniversary collection, ten games. There's uh, one through eight of the regular uh, series Mega Man that are normal. And then there's two that are arcade versions that never came to the United States until now on this uh, CD for the PlayStation 2. $20. That's nice. Brand new, too. See, it's unopened. It's sealed and unopened. $20. Okay, we got... Here I have a three-digit digit lock that um, when you when you have it like this and down, okay, so so you go like this, it's like this, right? Uh, let's see if I can get this. Oh, I guess I can. Okay, it's gotta be in. Okay, it's gotta be in that position. Okay, so so it's like this, right? Okay, lock. Let's say Is that push down. Okay, then you put your combination in, and, and uh, when you put the shank like this, and then you push it down, push it down while it's back like that, and then you s twist these numbers, these three numbers around, you put whatever number you want in there, and you pull this back up. Let's see. You pull this back up like that, and then you twist it, and you push it down like this, so it's locked, right? And you twist these numbers. Okay, so now it's locked. See? It's locked. See, now it's locked. You can't undo it. Okay, so then you put your three numbers in and you do it. And then, then you gotta, uh, it's under your own three numbers. So, um, you line them up with this red line because the back of it. Back we don't have a red line there, see? No red line. But the uh, front of it does. It has, a, it has a red line where you line them up. You go number, 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 like that. It goes from 0 to 9 on three tumblers. So, you have your own custom. You can change. You have your own custom combination of three digits, and you can change it at any time. Pretty nice lock. Sell it for five bucks. Keeps honest people honest, <laughs> and that's uh, that's all I have to say. That's that's what I'm selling.